If you're looking to boost your Mutt team or make some money by selling coins, check out MobileMaddenCoins.com. Use code CLICKWID at checkout for a 10% discount. Hey, what is going on, guys? ClickWood here back again with another Madden 16 Ultimate Team video. Guys, today... We're going to be trying to pull packs for Bruce Smith and Walter Payton, Boss Ultimate Legends, still in packs today. It is Sunday, so I am a little bit late on this, unfortunately, but that's all right. Uh, we've still got a plenty of an opportunity here to, to pull these cards. So what I'm going to do today, guys, is I'm going to go ahead and go in here and open up all of the four Ultimate Legend packs that I can pull with coins. Uh, so we're going to do that. I'll show you guys real quickly what is involved here. I think these 4th of July Ultimate Legend packs are just a little bit of an upgrade from the standard ones. So that's not too bad. Um, you do get a guaranteed 4th of July item, which I think the lowest price of those right now that's going for like 4,000, 5,000 coins. So, you know, something decent to get anyways. And you can actually pull a player out of it as well. So that would be nice to pull. If we could get that damn Bruce Irvin, that would be lit, son. But other than that, guys, uh, they do have a five Ultimate Legend pack bundle if you want to do that, um, where you also get an Ultimate Legend base player. Um, you know, not really anything spectacular, but, you know, if you are interested in that, it is there is the opportunity for you to do that. It's 50 or 5,000 points, which I think is around like 50 bucks or so, so I'm not really sure that that's worth it. But, you know, if you're interested in doing it, that is there for you. So, with that being said, though, guys, we do, uh, like I said, have four Ultimate Legend packs that we can open up here today, 4th of July Ultimate Legend packs. Kind of like the card art on these, too, by the way, guys. Take a look at that. Kind of cool. I love, like, the little fireworks at the bottom. Nice looking. But, uh, alrighty, let's do it, guys. Let's open up these packs. Let's see what we can do. I know Bruce Smith is going to be in here for me. Like, I'm I'm just feeling it today. Let's go. Come on. One damn time. And we get our Ultimate Legend badge. Those things are going for jack crap right now. We get a Chargers Fireworks collectible. Don't know if that one's rare. I know the Bucks one that I had was a little bit rare at least. Um, that one went for like 10,000 coins, which is like double the price of the rest of them. But other than that, we get a whole bunch of crap in this, as usual. A bunch of gold. Nothing special at all, unfortunately. Let's keep going, though. We've still got three more. I'm, I'm really feeling like I'm going to get this Bruce Smith, though. I don't know why. I'm really feeling it. I, <laughs> You guys can laugh all you want. We get a Bengals car, uh, collectible there. I don't know, man. Like, come on. I, I, I want to get something one time. And we get a... Okay. I was kind of right. <laughs> I was kind of right. There's a Bruce Smith. An 81 overall Bruce Smith. Not the best thing in the game. But uh, definitely something anyway. That's that's certainly better than what I usually get, which is just the damn badges. So uh, I will definitely take that. That's a that's a decent pull for sure. Let's compare this thing real quickly. Is this like the speed version? No, it just looks like it's... I don't even know what version this would be. Uh, yeah, I have no idea what this is. So anyway, though, um, decent. We got a Bruce Smith. Like I said, I was feeling a Bruce Smith. I was hoping it would actually be the damn boss legend, but hey, beggars can't be choosers at this point, mutt, man. Beggars cannot be choosers, and we get a JR Sweezy first card out of the pack. 94 overall right guard. This card might actually be good enough to start for me. Let me let me real quickly go in here and take a look at this. Yeah, he's comparable to my Alex Boone. Better run blocker, not anywhere near as good of a pass blocker, and not as good a strength. So, uh, yeah, we're going to stick with Alex Boone. But this is actually a decent card, though. Not bad. Not bad. We'll uh, we'll see what we can sell that thing for. Probably not a whole lot. But uh, we get the Legend Badge there. And a bunch of garbage, it looks like. Bill's Fireworks Collectible. Yeah, a bunch of garbage other than that. At least we got an Elite out of this pack, though. All right, guys. We've got, what, one more of these things? Wish me some luck, guys. Come on. That would be amazing if we could get a Walter Payton or Bruce Smith out of this. That would be freaking epic. I haven't gotten any of those all freaking year. No limited edition pulls, basically. And we get two fireworks collectibles. Okay. Could be worse. Those are at least worth a couple thousand coins. Crap, 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 crap. And we get an ultimate legend badge. And finally, a Packers jersey. So, unfortunately, we don't pull anything amazing out of here. We do get the Bruce Smith. So, I'm going to quick go back here and take a look and see what that thing's going for. Uh, but I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. I am going to be doing some uh, some other uh, like gameplay videos here over the next couple of days. So, be on the lookout for that. Um, I do have some, uh, some nice cards that I've added to my lineup that I think you guys be a little bit interested by. 
So uh, I do want to do want to bring you guys some gameplay. It's been I've been having some fun gameplay. I've been beating people's ass lately in Madden. I don't know, but uh, this card's worth about twenty five thousand coins. I was hoping that it would be worth more, but it is what it is. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, do me a favor, click the like button, subscribe to the channel if you're new, and I will talk to you guys again soon. Bye bye.